This is Tyler Jones. This is Jared Holloway. This is Austin Smith. <laughs> Yeah, a noun is a word that, that is used to name a person, animal, place, thing, or idea. Yeah, a noun can also function in a sentence as a subject, direct object, indirect object, a positive adjective, or adverb. Oh, thanks, guys. No problem. In the picture, Blake is holding his phone. Phone is a common noun, which refers to a person, place, or thing in a general sense. And you only write a word with a capital letter if it starts a sentence. A common noun is opposite of a proper noun and is sometimes used and sometimes you can make a proper noun out of a common noun. An example that shows three nouns is according to the sign, the nearest town is sixty miles away. The three common nouns are as follows sign, town, and miles. Jerry's Pizza is a proper noun. Really? Starts with proper nouns start with all ca with capital letters, and they describe a specific person, place, or thing. Thanks, I didn't know that. Well, you're welcome. Have a nice day. In the video you just saw, the boys bi racing big wheels, boys is a plural noun. Na plural nouns are usually nouns with an added es or s at the end of the word. An example is Austin picked up the box. Box can be changed to a plural noun by adding es to the end of box, thus making it boxes. Other nouns won't form a correct plural noun. When in doubt, consult a good dictionary. I'll see you later, guys. Thanks, Jared. I would also like to add that Austin fell onto the pavement in the video. Pavement is a concrete noun. A concrete noun is anything or any person that you can perceive through physical senses like touch, sight, hearing, or smell. Concrete nouns are opposite of abstract nouns, which we will learn about later in the video. In the video you just saw, Tyler was riding Jared's scooter. The possessive is Jared's. Jared's modifies the noun scooter. Possessive nouns show possession of an object, sometimes people. Nouns usually become possessive with a combination of an apostrophe and the letter S. An example is Tyler's room, spelt T-Y-L-E-R-S, apostrophe S. It can also be changed to possessive if it ends in s just by simply adding apostrophe to the n an example is the roommates slept in late spelt r o o r o o m m a t e s apostrophe also in the video tyler got angry angry is an abstract noun which names anything which you cannot perceive with your five senses Abstract nouns are opposite of concrete nouns, which we learned about earlier. Some more examples are love, hate, thoughts, and peeved. 